let's start with a brief recap on the importance of systems. Principle number two, we do not rise to the level of our goals, but we fall to the level of our systems. And systems are basically ways for us to take a certain input and then reliably turn that into a certain output. And for us to be able to do that, we need to continually attune our systems, both on the very micro level, but also on the more macro level. For example, the micro level is everything that we are doing during the day, right? So we're taking our energy and the knowledge and all of the things that we are doing during the day. And we want to translate that into certain actions, certain things that we want to complete. And to do that, we have our action tracker and we have our daily review. And that helps us on this micro level, take the input and turn it into the desired output. But then on a bigger level, we also have our project tracker and our weekly review, right? So during our project tracker, we're taking all these knowledge pieces that we've created. And once again, using the actions which are coming from the action tracker, we're using this smaller block to go into that goal that we have for our week, maybe the milestone that we want to hit or a larger chunk of action that we want to complete. And just like that, we also have a monthly review and a quarterly review during which we have smart goals that we want to move towards or that we have vision goals that we want to move towards. But the essence is always the same. We have a system that helps us take an input and then reliably turn that into an output. Now, an important note to make here is that our system is never going to be 100% accurate, right? Even if it's 50% accurate, we can already be very happy. So systems are going to be flawed. And that is why we need to maintain our systems. And that is exactly where these review cycles come in. So as a reminder, we have the circle of growth, right? We start with our insight, who we are, what is important to us, our core values. We then turn that into a planning, our vision goals, our smart goals, our milestones. We then structure all of the knowledge that we have, right? The knowledge pieces that we've collected and we've created. Then we execute on these things that we planned for ourselves. And then we review. And review basically means that we check in with our processes. We check in with our system to see if the system is still working, if it needs maintenance, if we need to tweak certain parts. And that is what we have this review cycle for. 